It's Euphoria Day, bitch. I was gonna watch it after I came back from uni, but there are too many spoilers on TikTok. I'll just come late to the lecture. Good for Jules. I like her. I like her. As she should. As she sh fucking should. Where is the worst? <laughs> Sorry about that. My antivirus has expired. I'm trying to buy a new one, but it's bugging. The website's bugging out. Really? You're proud of that? Even in this moment, she's so pretty. Ugh. Zendaya. Kind of keeps you from admitting what a shit fucking mother you are. What? What the <laughs> fuck? Oh, oh my gosh. This is so sad. Thank God she got that suitcase, but I don't know if she's put. Now shut up! I'm so I'm sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. She's you're scaring me, bitch. Oh, it's Elliot! Elliot here's a fucking addict. So if he tells you anything fucking different, he's a liar and a fucking snake. Fuck you. Chill out, what the fuck? That was fucking crazy. I got to like 24 minutes. I should give this quick question. Uh, this goes up to that dummy blonde girl from the last episode. Uh, uh, wasn't you just saying, I'm crazy, Nate? I'm, I'm really crazy, Nate. But when my good sis Maddie pressed you, you were speechless. I don't care how angry Maddie gets. I am crazier. You dumb fucking bitch. You run away from me, you stupid hair, you guys. I'm not even gonna lie, I felt a little bit bad for Cassie because all she came was with light and positivity and Root literally told her to go fuck herself. The place I left off was where she was running outside of the house, which is kind of what I'm doing right now. I was supposed to have left 20 minutes ago, but I didn't because I was watching Euphoria. If I was Rue's mum, I would have beat her the fuck up by now. I don't have patience like that, which is terrible. Which is why I don't think kids love me. I need to learn patience first. Because I don't want to be one of those people who abuse their kids. Honestly, Cassie's lucky that Kat is a good person because a lot of us, if we were in Kat's position, it would have been like, bitch, what the fuck do you mean, you fuck me? Like, you know when you get more angry for your friend than your friend is? Cassie's so lucky that all Kat said was, mm, that's not good. Because if it was some of us, beat the bitches ass. If I found out one of my close friends just got fucked over here, I'm going mad. <laughs> Kat's a better person than me. I can guarantee that. I'm not even gonna lie, I felt a little bit bad for Cassie. Because all she came was with light and positivity. And Root literally told her to go fuck herself. Like, <laughs> like what Rue said needed to be said. But at the same time, like, it's so crazy that the fact that if Cassie had just shut the fuck up, this wouldn't have happened. Cassie said, live, love, light. Anything can happen. Just be positive. Positive vibes. And Rue said, go kill yourself. Yeah. That is, that's mad. And then Cassie turns around and she's like, you're going to believe a drug addict. <laughs> she's so bad at lying. And my mind's like, what the f Like, if that was me, if I was Cassie, I'm not going to lie. I'm not saying I'm the best at lying, but I feel like I'd be very good at it. You know what I mean? Like, if we was to be like, oh, how long have you been fucking Nate Jacobs? I'd be like, what the fuck are you talking about? Immediately. Why was Cassie taking a pause? Cassie was, aha, aha, why are you talking up? Cassie, you're not busting this case. <laughs> and bro, seeing how, like, you know, the whole controversy of how dare... Like, that organisation in America that's, like, anti-drugs that's been saying that, oh, Euphoria glamorises drugs. Ah, after this episode, I am so sorry. I'm even scared to take painkillers. 
because i pop them painkillers like it's nothing i'll be honest when there's a little bit of cramping on my menstrual cycle i will pop 17 oh my gosh now i'm just sticking to the requirement maybe maybe even chop one in half <laughs> seem rude dude i'm a runner i'm a track star that bitch outran police you know that's crackhead behavior you know when they show videos yeah and they're like oh crackheads have superpowers that is rude rude has superpowers <laughs> Oh my gosh, that bitch jumped over so many fences, broke into somebody's house, outran the law, robbed people, all with one broken leg. That bitch was really handicapped. She had every L you could think of and she still won. She still beat Case. Crazy, man. I really thought, in my mind, I was like, do I want her to get caught? Obviously not really but in my mind it's like i do because i'd rather beat her be in prison than dead when she went to laurie's house i think that's how you say her name laurie lorangin that white woman is frightening when she was like that's what's good about being a woman because even if even when you don't have any money you still have something men want the nigger was too stunned to speak. I've been seeing a lot of reactions of people saying, Oh, Lorraine's so nice, Lorraine. Lorraine said she had no pills. Remember that? And then she opened up a suitcase full of pills and gave this bitch morphine. Morphine. Honestly, after like, this is me going back to the start, yeah? You know how people are like, people have been saying, Oh, yeah, Elliot's manipulative and da 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 da. I don't think Elliot's that smart. <laughs> like, these are 16 year olds. I don't think Elliot has some type of master plan. And I know people are going to be like, oh, but he said, um, I like Rue better before this and da 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 da. And in my mind, it's like, well, he's only known Rue while she was on drugs. Now she's in withdrawal. She's the worst person I've ever seen. Ever seen. Obviously, I'll prefer the, the junkie. I'll prefer when she's high than when she's doing this. She's a terrible person. What the fuck? She's horrendous. Horrible. Horrible. Can't believe they really flushed them drugs down the toilet. Because now Rue's finished. But honestly, when she was in the car, she was like, oh yeah, you guys, if you guys didn't intervene, I would have killed myself in like a month. I'm thinking, so you were never planning to return like think of a plan for those drugs you're just gonna finish them and die which in my mind it's like it makes sense because you can't go to that Lorraine babe empty-handed that Lorraine babe very scary very very scary i'm even shivering like she seems nice and i feel like people think she's nice because of the way she speaks she seems nice but she's not nice like she definitely locked her house up on purpose which is like yeah and pe people are even theorizing that there's someone else locked up in the house me personally i don't know i saw people say that she definitely gave rude the drugs on purpose because how can a drug dealer not see that someone's an addict i agree with that because in my mind it's like you deal with drugs and drug users all the time you're telling me you didn't you didn't see the signs because even now when she's like oh you lied to me you're lying to me now you're like it's very clear that she knew. That's why she just gave her morphine. Because, I don't know, maybe her whole aim was to get her um, so she could traffic her. Maybe that was the whole goal. Because, honestly, this bitch is a mess. I really want to see what Maddie does, though. I'm not saying I'm Cassie's side, yeah. 100% no, I'm not on Cassie's side. But do I really want to see her cry for a straight 50 minutes? Because that's what we're going to get let's be honest that's what we're gonna get cassie is going to cry the entire episode you were saying that oh i'm i'm, just, I'm as crazy as maddie you were saying that to nate and now look at you now look at you running oh you're moist man <laughs> don't act now you're in tears sorry sorry i know you're hurt man I know you're hurt by the consequences of your own fucking actions. But yeah, Mandy's gonna fuck you up. 
And I hope she does, honestly. But I don't want to see her tears. Because it's mad annoying. You're crying every episode. Shut up. <laughs> but yeah, I think that's all I have to say. See you next week.